It is arguably the most exciting hockey game of the playoffs happening right here in North Carolina. Last night, the Carolina Hurricanes stormed back from a 3-1 to one deficit in the third period to beat the New York Islanders in regulation time. Our very own sports team was in Raleigh for the rally of the season. I can't really pinpoint one guy. I mean, there was a bunch of guys I mean, that played really well. Jarvie was phenomenal. Svesh was phenomenal. I mean, I could keep going with Seabass, Jordo, Martin. I mean, they, everybody was just on it. In the third period, obviously, you, you ride that momentum that you built in the second and just try and keep it going. I felt in the third, it was just wave after wave. We were we were uh, coming at them, and we didn't give them anything, which is, which is key. And then, obviously, you, you push that hard. You're uh, hopefully going to get a couple, and luckily we did. I think you got to get home, and you got to kind of take a deep breath and then maybe watch the highlights because I was – like, when you're in it, you're you're in it, and your just sole soul focus is on the game. And then um, – there's some crazy things happening and game time goals and game like it and then obviously all the stuff that happens at the end it's just it's crazy so um, you just need to get home take a deep breath and maybe uh, rewatch it because that's uh, that was a fun one you want to take advantage whenever you can especially in this building you want to give the fans a good uh, a good show and I think when you can come out with two po or two wins in, in a series that's this tight it's huge. And now just kind of shifting our focus to Long Island, making sure we're ready to go because they're obviously going to want to win on ice. So just making sure we have the right mentality going in there and uh, trying to trying to close it out, but taking it one game at a time. The best of seven series shifts to New York for the game three Thursday night at 730 and game four Saturday afternoon at 2 p.m. Now, if necessary, game five would be next Tuesday at the PNC arena that is crazy mm -hmm. i wish i was in that arena yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. all i know is you know i've, I've got to get more into the hockey world and things of that mm -hmm. nature but i'll never forget that time i went to raleigh to go and visit and um, i found out there was a a, a, a canes game I mean, booked everywhere. Hotels oh. gone, packed yeah. out. I mean, people love them some um, some hurricanes. It's so, yeah. really popular. Yeah. You can hear it in the crowd. You know, I wasn't watching the game last mm -hmm. night. I don't follow that closely. But I heard a commotion in the newsroom that they had scored the goal, <laughs> right, to tie it. It's like, well, maybe I'll check this out. I mm -hmm. flipped it on. The second I got it on, they scored the next one. And it was all within like 10 seconds oh that they goodness. went from down Ten one seconds? to up one. And there was just only like two that. minutes left. So instantly they just won the game and kind of stole it away from the Islanders. I so think. That's always fun, yeah. mm -hmm. especially when it's in, you know, your team's favor. Yeah, we don't care about those Islanders. Mm -hmm. No hard yeah. feelings, though. Yes. <laughs> They'll be nope. fine. Shuffle on up there. We're going to get the rest, too.